Today I'm going to show you how to make these cute little Easter basket cupcakes. Uh, to do these, you're going to need, obviously, cupcakes. Uh, I make my own from scratch. You can use store-bought ones, whatever ones you want. Uh, you're also going to need uh, some of these Jelly Bird eggs. Uh, these just happen to be made by Brock's. You can use whatever brand you would like. Um, they are just little egg-shaped jelly beans, if you will, but they're quite a bit bigger than regular jelly beans, although you could use regular jelly beans if you so wish. Uh, and then for the handles, I got these Twizzlers. They are uh, rainbow Twizzlers in a multitude of colors. Uh, another thing that you're going to need is green buttercream frosting. Uh, I, there's plenty of recipes online as to how to make this. I put it into a pastry bag. You can also use a Ziploc bag with corners cut off. And I'm using a, um, I don't know how well you can see that, it is a grass tip on it. Uh, it is Wilton tip number 233. Uh, you can buy these at Joann's, Hobby Lobby, uh, even some Walmarts carry these as well, and they're only a dollar or two apiece. Now what you want to do is, um, for this grass tip, all you're going to do is put the tip about an eighth of an inch above the cupcake, and you're going to push it out and pull up, and that will create your grass-like frosting, just like that. And you want to go all the way around the cupcake and then fill in the center as well. And be sure and get it right on the edge. Look right there, I got a little far from the edge, but you want it right on the edge. Just like that. And then you're going to take your jelly bean eggs and plop them in the center as if it's a nest. And I'm going to go ahead and use, I believe there are six colors of jelly beans here. So I'm going to use one of each color. Just like that. And then for the handle, which is the Twizzler of sorts. Well, not of sorts. It is a Twizzler. I'm going to... I don't know how well it's going to stick just sticking it on there. So, I'm taking toothpicks and putting them into the cupcake on either side just like that. And the Twizzler has a hole in the end. Just put the handle on like that and kind of push it down into the frosting. Just like that. And there you go. And that right there is how I make Easter basket cupcakes. Hope you guys enjoy and thanks so much for watching.